Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. So let's see what's the current situation of your relationship. So after the previous reading, so I'm quite curious to know what's happening and I'm sure even you guys are. So let's see. So the first card here we have is a uh, knight of wands so this shows that they are very eager to come to you come back to you get back to you they are very eager and they are trying their level best they are trying they are trying to you know contact you through different me uh, mediums or you know different sources but at the same time they are holding themselves back because their ego is in between you know they are quite egoistic then we have the king uh, the justice yeah so definitely you will get your uh, answers you will get your justice so whatever they have hurted you whatever they have done to you you will definitely get your justice for that so they are regretful they are feeling really guilty they are feeling really sad so they are thinking about you every night <clears throat> so it might be like you know they are trying to you know talk about you to other people you know crying they might be crying as well so they are trying to discuss with their friends that i shouldn't have done this to them like to her or to him so i've done something wrong so they feel very very sad and you will definitely get your justice and if you also if you were in a very toxic or a very you know um what do you say like a very uh, abusive relationship so definitely the person is regretful okay and then we have the wheel wheel of fortune so this shows that there's going to be a very big change change in the relationship or change in the uh, you know change in your uh, needs or change in your preference or something like that you know or a change in something so there's going to be a huge change and this change will be very beneficial for you so maybe you have decided to move on you don't want to get back to this person or maybe you are waiting for this person but you want them to you know get their own medicine or know the value so sorry for the background noise so you want them to you know know your value so you are resisting yourself you're keeping yourself you're holding yourself you're standing your your you know standing for yourself you're taking that stand for yourself that stability uh, that grounding you know you're just controlling yourself at the same time they are also trying to control themselves not to contact you because the ego is in between but they have to they have to approach you okay and then we see page of wands here okay so this shows that you know <clears throat> they are trying to discuss about you to other people so they are trying to you know uh, compare themselves their relationship with other people maybe they have friends around they might be meeting up with somebody or they might be you know getting together with somebody and they are trying to compare or maybe they have some other uh, person in their life so they are comparing them to you and they are trying they realize their mistake they feel that you are much better you are like the best thing that happened in their life so now they are realizing because maybe uh, you know they found somebody who is not that up to the mark or maybe their friends are very happy in front of uh, that person you know maybe they are a couple and they are very happy so this person is seeing other people they are seeing romance and they are seeing love of other people they are see and they are feeling very very regretful of what they have done they are feeling jealous they are feeling sad so they are missing you when they see other people together or it can also be they are in a relationship with another person and that person is doing the same thing what they did to you so they are getting their own medicine so that's why they are feeling very regretful and they are understanding your value they are missing you a lot okay then again we have king of wands so here i see that as of now they are also stuck up in their uh, career so they are trying to build their career as well because they want to give you the best thing they want to give you the best stability for some of you you know maybe you had a, a breakup or your partner left you hanging around just disappeared maybe because of the career issue maybe they were not getting a proper job or uh, salary on time or you know they were not able to fulfill your dreams they were not able to give you the those things that you need or you were demanding or you were expecting from them maybe they were not able to give that to you so maybe that's why they felt they are very uh, helpless they felt very hopeless and they disappeared so now they are trying to you know figure out things they are trying to get back on track they might be applying for jobs which are very very better you know with better package and all that so that they can fulfill your dreams so i feel that they are more into career also as of now but at the same time they are thinking about you so here we have the four of swords so this shows that you are at a very better place you are peaceful you are not thinking about anything as of now you are uh, definitely you are missing them but at the same time now you are in a self healing kind of a situation 
you are healing yourself so you're not much bothered about what is going to happen so even if they come back some of you might take them back and some of you are like you know okay fine i i have had enough with this relationship so i can't take it anymore you know like that kind of a thing so that's so some of you might be you know thinking like that so uh, there's a little postponement that i see here another thing so they are trying to come towards you they are trying to approach you to contact you but at the same time because of the ego i see a little bit of postponement you know they are scared that if they come back to you you will reject them and then again their ego is going to hurt or they feel very you know they're scared that uh, if you reject them then uh, their self esteem or their self respect is going to fall off so you know they are they are thinking about all these things all these things are running in their head so that's why they are holding themselves back okay but at the same time they are getting very much attracted to send you the text they are holding their phone and they are you know looking at your messages they are stalking you on every social media they are typing the message but they are not able to send it to you okay because of these things hanging okay so they are at the moment they are hanging so they are stuck in something so some of you might you know some of your partners might be stuck in something maybe financial things or their job or some of you might uh, some of your partners might be going through some fi- family crisis something is wrong in the family you know somebody is not well or money issues money crisis they are not able to support their family so they are feeling very very sad you know they feel they are losing their self worth they are losing themselves so they are feeling very hanged or you know hanged up and also at the same time they are trying to look at a different way you know they are trying to uh, move away from all these things they are trying to run away from the situation that's another thing that i see here so some of your partners are not ready to give that commitment they are not ready to you know get into the relationship or to take that responsibility so they are trying to run away from the responsibility they are being very sneaky they are blaming everything on you they are reversing everything on you and they are giving excuses and they are trying to run away and some some people might have even disappeared without any reason or excuse yeah again betrayal so there might be a third party involved so this also shows that uh, some of your partners might get Uh, might have been influenced by other people maybe you know your partner's friend had a breakup and they're trying to compare your relationship with the friend's relationship and your partner feels that no uh, i don't want to end up like my friend maybe his friend or her friend is sad right now because of the breakup and all those things so your partner might be seeing all that and they are fearful they are feeling that no i don't want to end up like this so better it's too late let me just get back from my relationship let me you know leave my relationship or you know let me uh, run away from my relationship or maybe uh, your partner's friends or you know relatives or somebody you know who's married or someone who's not having a good uh, marriage life or they having some kind of an issue so your partner is seeing all those things and reacting in that way you know they feel that that's going to happen in their life as well so they are running away because of that you know maybe that can be a reason that they uh, you know disappeared in this relationship or maybe there's a third party involved as i told you that is maybe your partner is in another relationship or uh, maybe they are texting or chatting with someone or some colleague in their office or something you know they like somebody so they are involved in some kind of a, a relationship and they are trying to you know compare that relationship to you so that can also be a reason here so they might be comparing that to you and every minute they are missing you they feel that you were such a better person you were so humble you were so kind and you were giving you were a very giving person that's another thing that i can see here that you were a very giving person and your partner was the receiver so your partner is missing all that maybe the current relationship that he or she is in they are not receiving that love what they got from you so that's another thing so there's a heartbreak that i see here so this heartbreak can also be because of the breakup that happened so the let's see why this heartbreak also let's see even that what is the reason for this heartbreak is it the third party or what what is happening so yes because of over emotions as i told you so this can also be that uh, your partner is you know uh, this breakup happened because of a third party involvement or it can also be uh, it is because of comparing with other people and taking a very hasty very stupid decision 
or it can also be because of money you know money is involved here this king of pentacles so because of you know your partner is feeling that he or she is not uh, you know uh, in a situation to take this commitment or this relationship they definitely want to be with you they definitely want to see future with you but they feel they are not good enough for you okay that's another thing so money is involved some kind of a financial thing career so money and career is involved there's a lot of postponement so maybe that's why they are trying to hold themselves back and there's a lot of emotional flow here so this shows that they really love you they really they want to get invested with you they want to you know be with you forever they're crying you know i can definitely see her most of your partners are actually crying they're hiding and crying they maybe they are not showing it to you but uh, showing it to anybody but definitely they are crying and they are waiting waiting for the right moment you know they are waiting for that right time as soon as they get that job that they want or as soon as they get that money that they want they will definitely try to approach you okay so maybe they, it can also be that you know valentine's day is coming up so most of your partners might be feeling very sad that they are not able to give you or provide you uh, with the things that you deserve maybe they can't take you out uh, maybe they lost their job or you know uh, some kind of an issue so they can't gift you anything take you out or do anything for you so that can be another reason you know because that's another reason that i see here so hopefully if everything will be fine that's what they are thinking they are thinking that hopefully if they get the proper job or everything will be fine then they can give you and they can make this valentine's day special for you they can get back to you they can you know uh, come visit you with some kind of a gift or something like that and they can uh, what do you say they can uh, compensate for whatever they have done to you <clears throat> sorry the sun so this is what i told you so they want to be happy with you you are their happy place you are their home you know that comfort they have a lot of comfort with you and they feel very happy positive they love your positive vibes so they love that kindness that humble that positivity that you have that bubbliness that you know every time you are very happy no matter what happens you are very very happy you take the situation very calmly and you handle it but i don't see your partner being like that your partner is a runner so i i feel that your partner has always been like this that's another thing so i'm pretty sure most of your partners have always been like this they keep running away they keep disappearing they don't want to take any responsibility they want don't want to give a commitment they are always running away so i also see most of them always having a breakup and a makeup so this is like you know a never ending story okay that's another thing so they are definitely missing you okay okay so this is the hierophant so this shows that uh, they are not able to you know another thing is that people are not listening to them so or maybe they had some kind of a wrong guidance so you know uh, maybe uh, you know they had to invest the money somewhere they uh, took help from their friends or maybe somebody influenced them somebody would have definitely influenced because there's another card here okay betrayal and also this third party right as i told you so this can also show that uh, somebody has influenced them for this breakup you know somebody would have told them that uh, better leave this person or you know uh, and that third party is definitely having a wrong intention they do they can't see you guys together they are uh, you know uh, they want to destroy you both so they can be an possibility that you know the third party is involved here and they try to brainwash your partner or you know manipulate your partner and you know giving them wrong guidance and maybe that could have been a reason for this breakup so or it can also be money involved because there's money here job here so i guess maybe somebody had given them a wrong guidance or a wrong hope like you invest here or you get go to this job uh, it will be better for you and all and your partner went there or invested that money and your partner faced a loss a huge loss so this that is also a huge possibility and they're not able to face you because of this loss they're not able to face you and their family so they disappeared so this can be another reason and then they want to get married to you okay definitely they are seeing future with you they want to marry you they want to come back to you they want to celebrate with you and valentines coming 
uh, Valentine's is almost on the way, so they dream about you. They want to celebrate with you. That is for sure. And then here we have, they want to get back to you. See again. Or also it can be that someone from the past has come back to them. Okay, they, someone from the past has tried contacting them and they have come back to them and maybe you don't like that so they are trying to sneak around they are trying to hide that past person and they disappear because of the past person or you know maybe they are in uh, your partner might be involved with their ex again or maybe your partner is you know uh, involved with some other person okay so that can also be a reason and also i see here they definitely want to provide you some of your partners are very very sad because they're not able to provide you and they want to gift you something they want to provide you they want to get back to you okay that can also be a reason here and then here we have nine of cups so this shows that as of now your partner is very hesitant not taking a decision uh sorry for the background noise yep so as of now they're very laid back they are still in the thinking phase so th they are thinking about everything they are thinking about how to approach you and what to tell you how to give you a reason it can be you know they are trying to cook up some kind of a lie or some kind of an excuse so that they can you know convince you they can brainwash you they can manipulate you and also i see that you are at a better place right now some of you are not ready to accept them or some of you are in a very better place see again so some of you have already moved on some of you have already become independent you are actually enjoying this freedom and you are actually some of you you know uh, maybe you you guys were in a very abusive or a very on and off relationship and now you feel that burden is gone you know that burden is uh, reduced this relationship was very burdenful for you so now that is lightened up your life has become very free very light so maybe some of you uh, you know your partners were very possessive so even if you had to go out with your friends or you had to go anywhere out you had to take their permission or you had to you know uh, inform them and all those things you know even if you had to buy something you were very depended on them emotionally financially and all that so now you are at a very better place you have learn to love yourself you have become very independent maybe you're earning your own money and now you don't have to take anybody's permission so you're very free so some of you are enjoying this freedom and you know you're enjoying and you're you're very laid back you're at your comfort zone you're you're feeling like you're at your home you know you you are the king you are the queen you know that kind of a thing and then here so you are the high priestess so this shows that uh, there was somebody in your partner's life who has tried to brainwash them, who has tried to manipulate them and your partner got to know their reality, okay, they have got that awareness, they have got their intuition strong now, so now they know what is right, what is wrong and now they realize that they shouldn't have listened to that third person and taken this decision and now to get back to you, they are very egoistic. Okay, that's another problem here. Because of this ego, they are not able to get back to you. Okay, and also one more thing, you have, uh, you should start listening to your intuition. Okay, you know your relationship better, so start listening to your intuition. Okay, because if this person you feel that they are not right for you, then you should start listening to your intuition and taking the step forward of rejecting them, even if they come back to you. Okay. If you feel that you love this person and this love is true, then definitely you can give them a chance because I, I do see a reconciliation here. I do see that you're going to get back together. They will approach you, they will contact you and they will get back together. But I don't think you will be doing it because you are at a better place. So you're not going to contact them. You're not going to get back to them. That is for sure. And you have become very intuitive and you know what is right, what is wrong. So now you need to start listening to your intuition because your intuition is very strong. So if your this is another thing, if you feel or your intuition is telling something to you, listen to it because that is definitely true. What they are telling you or what they are portraying to you, that is not true because there is 
a betrayal here so somebody is being very sneaky your partner is being very sneaky so whatever your partner is telling to you that is not true okay but what you feel if you feel they are cheating you if you feel that they are uh, stuck in some financial problem or a job issue or a family issue or you know they are manipulated by somebody that is true okay so listen to your intuition because you know what is uh, right okay you because you are getting those hints you are getting those clues through somebody or through some social media or something you are getting those clues and you have a suspect on your partner that is for sure that i see here that you suspect something there's something in your head maybe that you know that they are cheating you you have got some kind of a small clue but you are under denial okay that's another thing that i see here so see you are fighting with yourself you are under denial so you are not ready to accept the reality maybe through social media or maybe through your friends or someone you got to know that they are cheating you or you got to know that they are in some kind of an issue and then uh, you know something like that but you are not ready to accept it you are not ready to uh, see the truth you are you are even if you get a small clue or a proof you are trying to think in a because you you are that kind of a person you are a very positive person so you are taking it in a positive way and you are trying to you are manipulating yourself you are fooling yourself okay so if you have got a small clue also accept it because that's the reality because there is high priestess here so that means whatever is your intuition that's the reality okay and then we have yeah Uh, for six of wands, so this shows that they will approach you with a bang. You know, they wanna approach you in the right way because they know what you want. They know what you need. Some of you might have, you know, uh, expressed your feeling about uh, taking the relationship to the next step. Some of you would have told that let's get married or let's have a kid, let's have a baby, or you know, some of you might have told let's get into a living together, let's. get a house let's get a car let's get a bike or something like that demands or some of you might have told them that uh, valentines day is coming up or my birthday is coming up or something like that so you have told them something and that scared them because they are not in the situation to fulfill those things so your demands scared them okay your demands scared them so much that they ran away they vanished or maybe you know uh, uh somebody's guidance because of that they vanished but now they are realizing what they have done is wrong they know your value so definitely they are fighting with themselves there's a lot of mental conflict that i see here uh both of you from both the ends even you are fighting with yourself not accepting the reality and even they are fighting with themselves because one side tells them to contact you to get back to you and the other side is very egoistic and fearful that if they approach you if you reject them it's going to be humiliating for them okay so they are in they are balancing in between two boats they are not able to take a decision so they are fighting with themselves okay and you both are fighting with yourself and both of your ego is coming in between but one more thing you don't approach them because if you approach them they will take you for granted okay and they will never realize their mistake because i do see here that the mistake is from your partner side not from your side so if you approach them it's like you are pampering them or pacifying them so they will start doing the same thing again and again so they might run away again in the future so now is the time that you need to set sit back you need to relax so the card here you need to relax you need to be you need to have patience you need to let them realize the value of you let them realize the situation let them realize their mistake so you need to wait okay and then they will definitely approach you if there is success so definitely they are going to approach you very very soon yeah see again so they are going to approach you very very soon that's another thing here so it proves here that they are going to approach you sooner and they are going to you know uh, reconcile they are going to uh you know apologize to whatever they have done and they will and uh, some of you i can also see that uh, because they want to get out of this relationship they have they would have hurted you they would have blamed everything on you and you know uh, they would have abused you they would have uh, you know like done certain things that would hurt you okay uh, you know like 
someone you don't like they would have spoken to them or something like that they would have purposely done something that you don't like or something that hurts you or they would have abused you used bad words or something like that okay or blackmailed you yes that's another thing your partner or some of your partners would have also blackmailed you so just to push you away because that moment something had happened somebody had manipulated them and they wanted this breakup they wanted to run away so that's why they did all these things so that you will leave them and go okay and when you didn't leave them then they tried to blame everything on you and they disappeared that's another thing so this also is possible they would have tried that game you know blaming game card and when you didn't uh, reciprocate with that they just disappeared so that can that can also be but they are approaching you and very soon they are coming very fast towards you so very soon they are going to try to contact you or they might try to you know talk to you through somebody else you know like that uh, from a third party they would try to approach you or they would try to contact you and also i see a little bit of long distance in certain relationship so maybe your partner is applying for a different place job or you know a different country different state or different kind of a job and because of that maybe your partner have to travel and they might be distant so i also see that some of you might have distance in your relationship as well if you're married or not so i do see a long distance relationship here so long distance can also be distance staying or it can also be a no contact situation or something like that okay and then we have the queen of cups so this shows that the are sad emotionally they want to offer you something they want to come back to you uh, but you know i am conscious they they are a very they want to share that love with you okay they want to make you happy because now they know that you are the best person they can ever get so now they want to make you happy they want to get you back in their life so they are planning they are thinking about it okay and then so we have the empress so this shows that uh, some of you might have had this conflict or this breakup because of fertility issue okay so maybe uh, one of you didn't want to have a kid or maybe uh, one of you cannot have a kid due to medical reasons or health issues so because of that your partner left you and when he you know he abandoned you or something like that or you know uh, something you know something related to fertility or maybe some of your uh, partner would have got attracted to the same gender and realized you know that they like the same gender or you know there's a gender change or there's hormonal change or you know something like that something related to fertility it can be anything and also some of you who are married might have issues because of the kid children involved so because of children you guys would have got separated so you know this high possibility for anything sneaky so as i told you uh, this is seven of swords so this shows that your partner has been very sneaky very very you know sneaky they have tried to uh, blame everything on you they have tried to get away from you by you know showing you as the bad person so there are certain partners who have been very very bad who have been very escape politics you know like a, they have played a very political game so what they have done is they have portrayed the world or they are sitting and discussing with their friends that you are like this that's why they left left you because you are the bad person you didn't support them or you didn't you were over demanding you are a gold digger or you were or uh, no you have some kind of a fertility issue or a health issue or you are not satisfying or something like that so they are bitching about you there's a lot of gossip that's going on there's a lot of bitching that's going on about you so they have done all that some of your partners would have done that as well okay so yes so this is what i can see here so let's see what are their feelings okay current feelings so you know your relationship better because see this is a general reading so this can uh, be relatable to some of you you know some of the things can be related relatable to some of you so you know your relationship well some of your partners might be a bitchy gossiping person some of your partner would have gone away from you because of distance some of your partner would have you know been very abusive abusing you or something like that 
or some of your partners you know because of financial issue or career issue they had to take a step back and they disappeared or some of your partner would have been cheating you and that's why they disappeared they thought the other person is a better option for them or something like that or because of some misguidance or comparing you with uh, their friends or their family or something like that you know so different stories different people so it depends on you uh, whatever resonates with you you can take it up but overall energy that i feel no matter what the reasons are overall energy is they will get back to you and they're thinking about you they regret they are very uh, sorry for whatever has happened and they are trying to approach you and they will approach you okay very soon they will come back to you they will get back to you okay that's the common energy that i feel here then no scope left in this relationship please let me go so this is what your partner felt and that's why they left you they felt there was no more scope in this relationship maybe the relationship got very boring to them or maybe they found a better partner or maybe you know um, you were demanding too much or something like that so multiple reasons so they felt this relationship is not going to work out and that's why they left you that's why they ran away that's why they disappeared i still want you to be mine for love uh, sorry i still want you to be my love forever see as i told you they still love you now they are trying to compare you with everybody they realize their mistake they know your value and they still love you and they dream about you they think about you every minute and they are trying to approach you okay no matter how much they try to battle with themselves they will definitely have to they have to get back to you okay here we have i am not loyal towards you guilt is taking me away see as i told you some of your partners would have cheated you or got into a third party situation so they are feeling very guilty they are feeling very regretful because they are comparing that third party with you and they got to know that you were the best for them okay and then you give importance to others which brought distance in our relationship so there could be a reason that a uh, time issue attention issue you know or financial issue because of that you were more uh, concentrating or your partner is more concentrating towards the family or the career or the friends or you might be concentrating with your career friends or part uh, what do you say uh, family or something like that so because you guys didn't have that understanding and uh, you guys were not concentrating on yourself both uh, about i mean on your relationship giving that time support in your relationship that's why this breakup would have happened let's pick one last card here um i never gave you respect and care you deserve it's all my mistake see as i told you they they are very regretful they are very regretful of what they have done so they feel they know their mistake and they will definitely approach you and they will definitely apologize to you so don't worry as of now they are in the karmic stage where they have to face their karma so as of now they have to face all of these issues and they will definitely take that step towards you and they will come to you and apologize to you okay so that would take some time because there's postponement so there's a little bit hold because they want to they are very uh, you know eager to do it they are getting very tempted to message you and tempted to uh, fix all this but they are holding themselves back because of that ego okay so don't worry very soon that ego and everything is going to go away they're going to give up they're going to lose their ego they're going to you know lose themselves and they're definitely going to approach you so as of now this is what i see let's see further let's see what's going to happen uh, in the upcoming days so if you like this video then please subscribe to my channel and click on that like button if you can resonate with this and that's about it then bye take care stay safe